Hey folks, this is Vince with Dan's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to check out the Omega Virus on Tabletop Simulator. The Omega Virus is based off of a very old board game that I used to own as a kid. Unfortunately, I don't have a copy anymore due to floods and everything else, but... I was really excited to get this working on Tabletop Simulator. You do need to install a separate emulator because there is a computer that's going to be talking to you and keeping track of things as you play the game. So um, once you download the emulator, the instructions are right here on the, uh, the board game mod. Once you get that working, you'll be able to uh, click the Start a New Game button on the emulator and the buttons in game here on this tablet will actually work. So by pressing 0, 1, 2, or R, you'll be able to interact with the game itself. You can look off to the side on the emulator to just keep track of what you've got going on there, but for the most part, you'll be able to do everything right here. So for those of you youngsters out there that don't know anything about the Omega Virus, this is a tabletop game where players are semi-cooperating trying to take out this virus. Um, you've got so much time to find the virus Find the three weapons that you need in order to take it out. Um, the first player to do that will win the game. You can initiate combat between each other, but I never did because it was just enough to get to the virus and destroy it before uh, the time limit ran out. So uh, here's a look at the game board itself. The game board is divided into four sections. There's the blue section, there's the red section, there's the yellow section, and the green section. There are a number of different rooms. Um, there's red rooms, green rooms, yellow rooms, and so on. You can start by entering the green rooms, but uh, you'll need key cards to enter the red, the yellow, and the blue rooms. So on your turn, you can move your guy three spaces. Uh, so this spot here counts as one, that's two, and then you can go into that room, that's three. But again, if you don't have the yellow access card, then you can't get in there. So I might want to go like one, two, three. Now once you land on a room, you can tell the computer, hey, I've entered this room, I want to explore it. So, there are different ways to interact with this thing. I don't remember all of them off the top of my head. Zero is to pass your turn to make way for another player. One allows you to do combat with another player. Um, I believe the game has... yeah. So, here's a quick look at the command codes. The 100 attack red commando, 110 is attack yellow commando, and so on. You'll also get probes as you play, and probes act as like a second player, but only the player itself, the, the actual person, the human that you're controlling, can actually attack the virus and destroy it. Um, hitting 2 allows you to explore that room, and when you hit a 2, it'll say, okay, which room do you want to explore, and then you type in the three-digit code, in this case, like 100. And then the computer will tell you, okay, you found, a, you found your probe, or... Uh, you found the yellow key card, or you found the decoder, or the negatron, or the disruptor. Those are the three things that you need to find the virus and eliminate it. Um, during setup, you'll also choose a unique two-digit code, like 01, or 22, or 00. When you hear your code on your turn, that means you found where the virus is, but everyone else doesn't know that. You're going to enter your code secret. So if you hear 00 and you've put in 00 during setup, that means the virus is in this room, but only I know that. So if you hear your code spoken on someone else's turn, it doesn't count. Okay, The computer knows what player is currently going right now, so um, it just keeps track of that. Um, I'm trying to think of some other things that might be important. Um, throughout the game, toward the end of it, sectors will shut down. And items will be moved around. So there's something to keep in the back of your mind. Um, the only thing that this game doesn't have is a way to keep track of um, what you've discovered so far. Um, the actual game, the board game itself, came with... Let's see if I can find... Oh, here it is. Bottom right-hand corner. It's kind of hard to see that. But in the bottom right-hand corner of that, there's like a little tracker. And you just you write in plus or minus or V for virus. Um, this particular tabletop simulator version doesn't seem to have that. So what I'm going to have to do is either make notes 
via the note on the right hand side over here or get a pen and paper and type it in manually, whatever. Okay, so let's see if I can get my emulator to work here. So one second. And the one thing I will warn you about, the computer will heckle you almost nonstop. It's annoying. It really is, but it's meant to be. So just warning you. All right, we'll create a new game. Um, okay, would you like to add five minutes to the timer to compensate for... So during the board game, the computer will heckle you, but ti the timer will stop during that event. When the computer is heckling you in the board game, the timer stops. In this tabletop simulator version, the timer does not stop. So the computer is now asking me, do you want to add five minutes to this to compensate for the heckling that you'll get? Um, yes. Okay. So it is now starting here. All right. Player has joined. Okay, so connect clients and press end to start or that to exit. Okay, so I'm going to type in end to start. Enter skill. Forgot about that. Enter skill. All right, so let's go ahead and I guess we'll choose skill zero. Zero. Red, enter secret code. All right, so at this point, if Red were playing the game, they would enter their secret code. If Red is not playing the game, they hit R to skip. Yellow, enter secret code. Green, enter secret code. I think we'll display with blue. Blue, enter secret code. All right, so zero, zero. Red, enter secret code. All right, now it's asking us, you sure you don't want to play with these Yellow, people? Yellow, enter secret code. Green, enter secret code. 25 minutes until I take over. Blue, help me do something. Okay, so from here I get to move three spaces. I don't have any key cards yet, so I can only enter the green spaces. So one, two, three. So I can go with two. Enter room code. And then I have to enter, I think, one, zero, zero. One. Zero. Zero. Yellow. Access card. Found. Ah, code. Cool. One, two. Blue. Hurry. Do something. You human scum. <laughs> Alright, now I have an Excel spreadsheet open. Um, I'm typing in what I'm finding in these different rooms. Um, you can try and write Blue, it down, but it's it, keeping track of all of it is difficult on Ooh. pen and paper. Unless you organize it by the four different quadrants in the game. Okay, so um, now that we found the blue access card, um, there's one, blue, one, one nearby. Do something. Let's do one, help two. Me, we'll do this first. Me, you fool. Enter room code. All right, so that was room one zero two. One zero two probe found code ah. zero one. Blue probe. Hurry. All right, we so when you earn a probe. Help me, help me. You put it on your character. <laughs> and all the probe acts as you too. The probe can't actually battle the virus when you have everything, but it'll help you explore around a bit. Um, we'll go to, um, one, one, zero. We are running out of time. <laughs> you fool. Help me, help me. This is constant. Which room? One, one. Zero. Security breach. Security breach. At one, one, zero. Blue. Probe. Energize. Two. Shields. Oh, there goes my probe. Blue. Probe. Destroyed. So. Code two. One. Blue. What happened there? You That's a trap blue. room. You <laughs> are asked, energize two shields. There's four buttons. If you pick the wrong button, you explode as a probe. If you're the player, you lose a key card, what have you. So we don't want to enter, ever enter 110 ever again. So we'll mark that on my Excel spreadsheet. Okay, so let's go up to room 111. I do have the, I don't have a blue access card, so we'll do... Stop me, you I have a yellow, so we'll go this way, 1022. Which room? Zero, two. Two red access card found code two zero. Blue, hurry, 
do something. Try and stop me, you fool. All right, uh, we've got the red one, so we'll go up to zero two one. And your room code. Zero two one. There's a teleport room. Blue teleported to red docking bay. Code zero two. Blue, help me. We are running out of time. He 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 ha ha ha. You human scum. Help me. Help me. <laughs> it's so annoying. Um. All right. So we'll go to zero one two. Which room? Zero. One. Two. Oh, another teleport. Blue teleported to red docking bay. Code zero one. Blue, help me do something. Hee hee hee. All right. Um, we have the yellow key. Uh, let's go to the. We don't have the blue one yet, so we'll go to zero Blue's one zero. Hurry. We are running out of time. Fool, help me, help me. Which room? Zero, one. Zero blue access card found mm. code one zero blue do something you human scum cool okay so it looks like we've got blue most of them me. okay so we've you got all the access cool. cards so now we need the three <laughs> items the three items are found in the yellow red and blue rooms uh, one in each room let's go to zero one one which room zero one, one, security breach, uh -oh. security breach, at zero, one, one, blue, energize, two, shields. Oh, we're safe. I missed code, zero, one. Blue, hurry, we are running out of time. You fool. One, two, three, and then another turn, one, okay, zero, zero, two. Let's check that out. Twenty minutes until I take over. Fool. He 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 ha ha ha. Which room? Zero. Zero. Two. Probe. Found. Code. Zero. Zero. Oh! Code zero zero. That means the virus is in this room. So I'm gonna mark virus. Alright. So now the probe's turn. We're gonna go to zero zero one. Enter room code. Zero. Zero. One disruptor found uh, code two zero. Blue disruptor. Help me do something. That's you one of the three items some. that we need. Help me, help me. Okay, so we're gonna cheat a little bit. We're gonna go like one, two. We're gonna skip zero zero. Land here. That means we have to hit. Blue, well, we're not gonna cheat. We'll just hit me. R two or zero to skip. He he he. Blue probe. Help me do something. <laughs> the probe moves um, as many spaces as needed to get to the next room. It doesn't move three spaces. It can never end on a space that isn't a room. Um, we'll go to two one one. Hurry, we are running out of time. You human scum! He 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 ha ha ha! Try and stop me. Enter room code. Two, one. One Megatron found mm. code zero one. Blue, hurry, do something. He he he. Alright, the decoder's <laughs> in a yellow room then. Again, you're gonna find one of each item in each different colored room. So we'll skip uh, all these other rooms. We'll just head Blue, to say me. one two one over there. One two you three. Fool. I'm gonna skip that room. Just hit zero. Blue probe, do something. You fool. <laughs> Alright, so we haven't been to two the probe has to enter a room. So I'll just I'll just go here and two one zero. And your room code. Two one zero. Nothing here. Mm. Code one two. Blue hurry. Okay. Uh, again we're gonna make way to this yellow room if we can. One, two, three. We have to skip our turn. Blue probe, do something. We are running out of time. I could skip the help probe's me, turn too if I really wanted to. Me. But 201, let's just see what's in there. Enter room code. Two, zero, 
one, nothing here. Code one zero. Blue, do something. We are running out of time. Alright, so one, me, two, three. Me, I don't want to investigate that. Uh, we'll skip. Blue probe, help me do something. Enter room code. One, two. One decoder. There's found the decoder. Code two one. Blue, help me. We are running out of time. Okay, so Try we have everything. Me. He, 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 ha, ha, ha. According to this, we've got everything. So I'm gonna cheat a little bit. I'm just gonna skip all the way to the virus room. Normally, I'd have to skip, move three spaces, skip, skip, move three spaces, skip, skip. But for the sake of the video, we're just gonna keep it flowing. Blue, hurry. If, you fool. if the computer says blue must be destroyed or red must be destroyed, that means that that player knows the location of the virus. It may say it now, I don't know. Blue, but now we're gonna enter. Me, uh, it was the virus room you that fool. was. Uh, what was that? I thought I wrote it down. I think, oh, zero, zero, two. All right, so let's go ahead and enter 002. Which room? Zero. Zero. Two. You found me. Try and stop me. Okay, so I have to pick one of these numbers. Wrong. Wrong. Blue probe, hurry. We are running out of time. Help me. Help me. It's one of those four Ooh. numbers. I just have to find it. All right, so I'm going to skip the probe. Blue, hurry. You fool. Help me. Help me. That's so annoying. <laughs> Which room? Uh, zero, zero, two. Zero. Zero. Two. You found me. Try and stop me. Try the one this time. Nope. Wrong. Fool. Blue probe. Hurry. We are Skip. running out of time. Help me. Help me. Blue. Help me. Do something. Help me, help me. Fifteen minutes until I take over. Plenty of time. You fool. Help me, help me. Try and stop me. Which room? Zero. Zero. Two, you found me. Try and stop me. Oh, come on. Wrong. So Try it's just the R. This, it's me. gotta be the R. Help me do something. So, the, the, um, the virus will only reveal itself to you when you have all three items to, to destroy it. That's why, before, when we entered it, it gave us a code. We are running out of time. Fool. Enter room code. Zero. Zero. Two. You found me. Try and stop me. Got it. Finally. You human scum, you win. I am terminated. <laughs> so that is the Omega Virus, folks. Um, you know, back in my day when we had the physical board game, this was this was awesome. The computer keeping track of stuff, trying to find the virus in the board somewhere, uh, finding key cards and trap rooms. Um, this tabletop version, I'm so glad that someone made this and an emulator to make it all come together. So kudos to whoever you folks are for getting this uh, squared away because this is 100% nostalgic fun. If you guys haven't already, subscribe to me on Twitch and YouTube. That way you can stay up to date with any new content I have to publish. This is Vince. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys next time.